Okay, we're gonna make, we're gonna flip over to our product recipe book. We're gonna go to the essential oil aromatherapy bath soaps. And we're gonna do the Dead Sea Salt Mineral Soap layered this time. So layered means it's gonna have a couple of different layers. Salt, or salt. So we're gonna do the retire to deep sleep. We're gonna do it with essential oils. And this is really great because This is an excellent gift item because it looks so cool when you make it. So we're gonna go to our heaping eight ounce, our big, our cup, and we're gonna make sure this is heaping. Now, I would say this is not heaping. Just a little bit more. Maybe that was like a little too much. Okay. Then we are gonna do, we're gonna start this way. This person wants a little bit of herbs in all, in throughout and in the middle. So they, we're gonna do the retire to deep sleep. We're gonna use the relaxation blend. We're gonna scoop this. You know what, we're, not, we're actually gonna do uh, lavender and chamomile mixed in this one. So we're, you can do that, you can blend. So we're gonna do a little bit of lavender, a little bit of chamomile, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna put that in pestle and mortar. So you know what's so fun about that is? customer gonna mix herbs. So this is like total mix and match and create your own. And this is what makes this bath bar so fun. So we're mixing lavender, chamomile, we're grinding that up. And this needs a little time to grind up because the chunks are so big. I wanna make sure people don't get their, clog their drains. So this smells really good. Has lavender in it. It really comes out when you grind it up. So you're gonna add a little bit of this. And you don't want to add too many herbs because you don't want this to be an herb bath, right? So here's that. It's grinding up. We mixed it up. Now we're going to add our essential oil. This is a layered one, so we're going to start. We're going to add our scoop. We're going to add our quarter ounce of essential oil to this and our blend is retired. So that's point two. We're gonna get it to point two, we're gonna stir it up, it smells so good. I can see some of these salts need a little bit of extra grinding, so you can kind of pick those out with your spatula and put it in your pestle and mortar and grind those up. Like this one is kind of big. I can't get it with my spatula, so just put it in the pestle and mortar and grind it up later. Just that way it doesn't clog your funnel when you start. Okay, so we're gonna pour this now. This just goes in really nice and easy. And you can see how it's starting to look when it goes into the glass really nice. So you can see all the herbs from, from the, uh, the lavender and the chamomile. And then you can see salt from our Dead Sea Salt Mineral Soap. This is layer one. It's really starting to look nice. Okay. And so this is layer one. We're gonna do layer two now. So we're gonna do our herbs. A little bit more the chamomile, a little more lavender. And we got it to the two. So we'll grind this up a little bit, and then this is actually gonna be a really good amount. So we'll grind this up. So you're not gonna add essential oil to your herbs. They don't need that. They already, they already have enough really great properties. So you don't need to add any essential oil to the herbs. So we're gonna put that right in. And if you feel like, oh my gosh, this is too heavy, this is too big, just dump it right into your glass. 
and you can fill it from there if that's easier. I know some people have a larger pesto and mortar and that might be kind of heavy or uncomfortable. So here we go. We're going to scoop it right in just like this. And then you're going to give this a little tap so it just kind of evens out. But see how nicely you got a mixture, you got your herbs, and then this customer here selected dead sea salt. So we're going to add dead sea salt. So we're going to add a eight ounces of that. Oops, sorry. And bath soaks are really awesome when you have big, big ones. So you, they could pick fine if they wanted, but fine is a little bit better when you want, um, when, you, when you're looking for a scrub. But even if they wanted, we're doing eight ounces. So let's say they want a mixture of fine and small. We could do, we could find our quarter cup, because two of, I mean our half cup, because two of these equal one of those. So we'll do a half cup of heaping and a half heap, heaping of the small. So they'll have a combination of salt. So then we'll mix that together. Uh -huh. Sometimes people like the, to do a mixture because if the big ones don't dissolve all the time when they're in, their, in the tub, it's a little bit uncomfortable on your hoodie. So, <laughs> um, this is gonna get a quarter ounce because it, it gets a half ounce total and we already added a quarter here. So we're gonna add a quarter here. So we're gonna get to point two. Okay. We're gonna mix that up. So then you have dead sea salts here, mixture of fine and fit small. Mix it up. Now we're gonna put it back in. Now, dead sea salts tend to become, like, just naturally, they have water in them from the Dead Sea. So these become a little bit wet. So you can definitely see that, where the mineral soap looks a little bit drier, and that's because it has baking soda in it that kind of dries some, sucks the liquid. So sodium bicarbonate is baking soda. So you're going to tap that. Done, and you can see the layers really looking nice. So, this is really looking good. It's almost full, we almost got it all in. You know the customer likes when we get almost every drop in, right? So we're getting that right now. So here we go. Put it in there. Look how nice and full that is. This is what it looks like when it's layered. You've got your herbs in there with your mineral soak base. You have er additional herbs and then you have your dead sea salt. So to label this one, we're gonna go over here to the label and we added dead sea salt, it's already done. We added chamomile in here. You're gonna check that. We added lavender. I'm gonna check that. And we we didn't add a booster, but you could to this one add oatmeal, or goat's milk, or aloe powder. And so if you were gonna add a booster to this one, you would go and you would add one of these, and you would add a half a teaspoon, you would add a tablespoon, sorry, a tablespoon for the entire booster, for the entire soak. So you would do a scoop like this for the entire soak. And that would be good in the retire. So if you, that would be a really good one, goat's milk or oatmeal. Either of those would be really good in that one. So this is your retire to deep, to deep sleep bath mineral soak. And this is a really awesome product to pair with the bath tea. So you've got your tea. 
what we have here is $30, $30, two for 50. So package these together and then they'll have a box, the kit of four and kind of the base. So this is an awesome way to, to, to pair two products, two for 50.